smart player, a lot of fundamentals. He just, I don't think he likes the tournament scene anymore because he didn't enter singles, he only entered doubles. Well, let's see what he has to offer here. Already Mocha, he is going Sonic over his trademark Bayonetta. Doing a very strong, strong job of just controlling the floor and getting his enemies popped up into the air. Christ is trying to take control of that left side as Honestly, people are just thrown over to Crisis' side repeatedly for a follow-up punish. Right, and there's not too many follow-ups, but they're playing such solid basic games, catching their opponents at any chance they get. Ooh. Tech ends up being missed right there, and that will be a strong up smash coming out of Crisis. Already, Corn on her second stock. Villager is almost on his way as well. Mocha keeps making sure that Villager cannot get any of the projectiles thrown out early. Ooh, and there's a back grab. throw. Just barely misses the up smash. It's unfortunate. Crisis looks like he's very aware of the floor right now. Their stage control is looking very solid. And Red Team, I feel like they're just playing uh, 1v1s and not really working together as a team. That can be a very big issue when facing off against teams who have very strong teamwork, all sorts of follow-up strategies. Nice double down was, air for a lot of damage. Cute. Oh, Mocha falls right into an up smash crisis, though. As that villager gets high percent. Team Meme has yet to take a stock off a of blue team, and they are already within kill percent range. But they're getting close. Oh, with this. Ooh, nice bait. Just holds uh, the villager, waits for Korn to try and save, and just takes advantage. And Korn's Mocha taking two stocks right there, one with that up air off the side of the stage, and an up smash finally, in the middle of it. Finally, Red Team takes a stock with that bowling ball, but they still have a massive deficit to make up for. Crisis is doing his best to keep the pressure off of Mocha so that Mocha can just do what he does best, and that is get those players over to Crisis for a punish. Shield dangerously low on the villager. Nice down smash ends up taking off Mocha's first stock. Oh, what happened? Corrin looks like she had an SD. Probably thought that uh, she had another jump. Might have down aired off stage accidentally. Because no one was there um, doing like an edge guard. Solid oh. down air right there into an up smash, catching the lag off of the down air. Very well done from that blue team. Very solid first game. Now, uh, the red team, it looks like their main issue is that they are not defending each other all that well so far. And uh, there haven't been a lot of strong follow-ups coming out of them. Their spacing has been a little bit off between each other, leaving each other in positions where they could end up uh, team killing. But I think if they end up taking over a little bit more control of the stage by focusing down Mocha and pinning Mocha into a corner, uh, it'll lure Crisis in and they'll have a much better chance, especially with Villager being able to throw out those forwarders and back airs to push Luigi away and focus on that Sonic. I also feel like Corrin and Villager, just as characters, could cover options phenomenally. Yeah. Corrin's got his extremely long range forward smash that covers a lot of grounded ledge options, and Villager just can cover the air for free with uh, slingshots or nair or turnips. So they definitely do have options available to them. But it all depends on how they end up using them. Let's see how it goes here on Town and City in Game 2. I do like this. They have a little bit of space, and their kills have mainly been off the top with uh, the up smash and the bowling ball. Really good defense on blue team's side so far. Although do blue team has taken way more damage than red team so far. That's changing quickly. Oh, almost nope. end up getting the gimp. He does it again. Crisis making it back to the stage with two down B attempts and follows up with that another was, smash off of Mocha's grab. That was very impressive. Oh. That was, that was a nice catch on the back throw. I wasn't expecting uh, Sonic to get grounded there. And yeah, very strong work from Crisis so far. The red team has actually held their own fairly well up to this point, other than that very strong gimp that we saw. Mocha, though, once again, holding down stage control means a lot more against the red team than what they may or may not realize. Which misses the uh, instant grab for the missing pin. 
Mocha goes for the throw. Christ is still putting on all of this pressure on the left side. It seems like this Ooh. is where they end up functioning the best. Christ is holding down the ledge while Mocha just continues to throw his opponents over into Crisis for uh, either a direct punish or an edge guard afterwards. A villager already lost two of his stocks. He's kind of... Oh! And he just uh, pockets off the stage, and unfortunately, too much lag for him to make it back. Looks like they're not going to take the stock, though. Yeah, team, the red team. There okay, we there we go. Finally taking the stock there. But leaving Korn in a bad position to take 24 early percent. Luigi, though, ends up getting killed from that nice lance. Mocha breaks up the aerial team of the reds. Aerials, I should say. Uh, with that nice down air. Crisis holding down the floor. And they're running into one-on-one. -on -one. Putting so much pressure on the villager. Yeah, and honestly, when both members of one team are both succeeding in the one-on-one, -on -one, no reason to not just let it go. This corn is getting into some higher percent, but the pressure is on. Crisis ends up eating a smash attack from Mocha. Ooh. Mocha doesn't look as crisp with his movement right now as he has, but that sneaks back here. almost doing it. Oh, that was catching the uh, bunch. Wow. Mocha with all these back airs <laughs> and the <laughs> SD. I mean, that is going to get rid of some of the rage, but Crisis ends up cl cleaning it out with a back air of his own, and that is a 2-0 in favor of the blue team. Definitely looking very strong right now. Yeah, solid work from...